Today is gonna to be a cool day because I am heading to Silver Springs to paddleboard with manatees. If you don't know what a manatee is, just go ahead and Google saltwater potato and uh, Florida in one search and it'll, it'll pop up. They're gentle giants and they just, they look adorable. They're little sea puppies. I've got clothes, I've got chargers, I've got all sorts of bags and supplies all around because even though it is only the start of February, when I leave Florida in a couple, uh, tomorrow, I'm not gonna be back for three months. I've taken over this Airbnb and I've been you know, packing and organizing and getting ready for you know, being gone for three months because I'm gonna be in a lot of different climates. I'm going to Ohio, Idaho, up by the Canadian border, then it's off to Portugal, Morocco, I'm gonna be in the desert. So I'm trying to accommodate all of the different regions that I'm gonna be in. So that's why this place is trashed. Before I get on the road to Silver Springs, I am going to grab a quick bite of breakfast. I've actually been referred to this place once before by a different Airbnb owner, and it is supposedly like the place to go for breakfast sandwiches in Jacksonville. You know, when one person says it, you think, okay, sure, this person probably really likes this place. But when two completely independent, disconnected people recommend the same place, I'm gonna bet money now that it is worth going to it. This sandwich is the Mr. Loco, and I can see why. Now, I have been paddle boarding before. That is not the element of this that I've never done. The part of that, the part of this that is something I've never done before is the paddle boarding with manatees part. So it's super awesome that I have this opportunity living in Florida. There are areas where you can go swimming with them too. But for today, I think the plan is only to paddle board with them, which is gonna be fine. Uh, I don't paddle board nearly as much as I would like to. And I'm excited that I'm getting back on the water and there's gonna be manatees there as well. All right, you can see behind me, this is the entrance to Silver Springs. Um, it is a state park. So there's gonna be a park fee to get in there and actually be situated for going on the water. There's a lot of activities here. There's a glass water or a glass bottom boat. There's just a park you can walk through. So uh, it's a really cool place. I got here a little early. Um, my guide is going to be showing up in the next 15, 20 minutes or so. I'm gonna go get my backpack ready. I've got a new dry bag that I'm gonna test out. This is something that I'm gonna start traveling with just so I feel a little bit more comfortable taking the camera gear and equipment out onto the water because I wanna do this more. So I'm gonna get this put together. All right, so here's everything. Backpack, this stick I'm probably gonna use on the water. Brand new dry bag, the drone and the GoPro stuff. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do, if I'm even gonna bring this with me, but uh, as far as the GoPro stuff goes, like I don't need the DJI mic, I'm not using that for this trip. I don't think I've got the mounts to even really take advantage of the fact that I have, this will come in handy, I can put the GoPro on the Insta360 stick. And the rest of this, I think, can stay. I don't have to worry about that. Memory card should have been in there too. This makes me nervous. This is going into the bag loose. I normally keep this really well protected in its case, so I'm not sure exactly. Uh, I'm not very happy about that, but I don't have a better option right now. All right, so the dry bag, it's over on itself. I'm supposed to burp the air out of it. This rolls back, clips together. That's my dry bag. So the drone is safe, and my wallet and my keys and all that sort of stuff is safe. This is then going to go in the backpack, which will be on my back. My guide just showed up, dropped off my board and the paddles and whatnot. She's getting her board now. And then we're going to be checking in for so board sports, paddle sports. It's all done through there. You got to pay your admission, your entry fee there to get to the launch. And then uh, it's out onto the water. All right, I've launched on uh, my paddle board. Just waiting on my guide, Ashley, to get her board down here. She's launching right now.
So we are at uh, one of the many spring heads that are here at Silver Springs and we found mama manatee and a baby manatee and they are down here. I'm gonna try and keep the nose of my paddleboard not over top of them, but I'm gonna also give you a look at what's going on here. I don't know if you can see it behind me and I'm gonna try and crop it in when I edit the video, but there's a mama gator back there with a bunch of little baby gators and they are just sunbathing right now um, here at Crystal Springs. And just to give you an idea, we're not very far away from the glass bottom boat launch area and we're already seeing all sorts of wildlife. A couple of manatees, baby manatee, lots of fish, but now we got mama gator and the babies back there. I don't know if you can see them over my shoulders, but back there, towards the tip of my paddle here, there's a mama and a baby uh, manatee. And they're just in this cove, totally on their own. And we paddled in here and we've been undisturbed the whole time. There have been people paddling up and down the river near us, but they haven't ducked in. Just made for a really cool, kind of quiet moment with these two manatees. They're just beautiful. And uh, wow, what a cool blessing. So that was the short loop um, down here at Silver Springs. Took us about two and a half hours round trip. Spent a little bit of time sitting with the uh, manatees. So it was a really awesome experience. I took some time to download some of the photos from the GoPro and uh, they're upside down because the camera was upside down, but just, you gotta understand, this trip was amazing. Uh, so cool to be out in nature like that. It's peaceful, it's calm, it's still, and you're just crystal clear water, this this wildlife. Um, just really a, a, a neat place to be for just connecting with, with the nature, the, the environment that's around, so. <sighs> that was a good trip.